Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. I got another video for y'all today. Like I said, I'm gonna be dropping videos every day, y'all, so come check on me. And before we get any further, stop what you're doing and please drop a like on this video and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already so you can keep up with me. But yeah, let's not do too much talking and let's get right into the video. For starters, we gotta start with the purse of the day. And that's this Barbie car purse right here with my Barbie doll in it. This was actually my Halloween costume last year, so yeah. I decided to put that on today, and yes, I'm sitting on my dresser, y'all. I don't know, I just felt, like, fired to get up here. I uh, moved my TV off my dresser, and I feel like I should be the form of entertainment right now. So, why not do it up here? And plus, the lighting is fire. So, yeah, let's jump into it. First, we have is this Coca-Cola purse right here. It opens like this. Here's a little view of the inside of it. And yeah, I don't have a the scraps on a lot of my purses because they just get all over the place and I don't really have anywhere like to store them so I try to keep it inside so I won't lose my scraps so when it becomes time to use my purses everything will all be in one place and still be intact so yeah this is my coca-cola purse right here and I got this one from the purse vault next I have is this milk bag right here I really like the colors pink is one of my favorite colors so you know and it went well with my little sequin jacket and here's the handle on the inside of this one I don't have it attached and yeah that's the inside of that and here's the back here's a close-up next is my hot tamales purse i know y'all probably seen this yesterday well it says hot headed so if you have a temper i would definitely suggest this for you and cash apologies only and yeah it has the nutrition facts on the back Y'all, my window is open and these kids are playing across the street. Like, I know they're screaming, but they're perfectly fine. That's what kids do. They scream. I don't want you to think, you know, something's going on weird. But next I have is my Ugg purse right here. I got this purse when I got my Peppa Pig Ugg boots, as y'all like to say. Or my mom likes to say. See, I actually use this purse. That's why I stuck in it. But yeah, this is one of my purses that I carry very often because it matches my boots. And it has, like, the little Ugg wrap. And yeah, next I have, like, this little cow printed purse right here. I love, like, the material it's soft it's like you're touching an actual cow but it's not made out of a you know it's faux fur it's not real but um here's the inside i haven't used this purse yet y'all have an outfit that would be fire with this purse but it just didn't pan out for me so i don't know i didn't like it when i like put it on and took the fig picture so like if you feeling like the cow vibe hit me up because i got an outfit and a purse for you because yeah i'm telling you it's fire Next we have is this ramen noodle pouch purse right here. Let's see. I actually lost the handle to this. It's probably in one of like my little bins. But yeah. It's the ramen noodle soup purse. I really, really love this. I got this to match my Yeezy 380s. And yeah, I did take pictures with it actually. But I didn't like them. But yeah, this is my ramen noodle pouch purse. I know quite a few of y'all keep saying, oh, do a ramen noodle purse. You know, I already got one right here. So yeah. Here's another cow purse. I really love this one. I actually used this one and took photos with it. And yeah, it's like very different. It's like vinyl type of cow print versus the other one where it was kind of like soft and furry. But yeah, I really like this purse. Next we have is this Trix bag right here. I really, really, really like this Trix cereal bag. I got this a couple years ago, so it's been with me for a while now. It's a cereal box right here, and then it has the checkered on the back, which I really, really like. And I have my strap attached to this one. And here's the inside. It's just, you know, you can fit quite a bit of stuff in here, like your phone, your wallet, and a couple other things, like car keys. But yeah. I really like this one and I like the fact too that it's like really solid because you know like some purses are easy to bend and all this you're not bending this one but yeah I really like this one next purse I have is this Dolls Kill TV purse I really like this I was sent this by Duck from Dolls Kill and I really 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 like this I'm pretty sure this is much more compatible than my actual TV purse like y'all if you want a TV purse y'all go get this one it's a lot lighter but yeah I really 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 like the glitter sparkle thing going on you know and like the tv screen i really like it it has multiple compartments where you can put your items in and it has stickers on the back of it yeah i really like it next we have is this eyeliner bag right here really really or crossbody bag i really really like it it opens like this it doesn't have like a zipper on it so you might It doesn't have a zipper open, so it kind of like a magnetic pipe. Like, it's like, you know, so just be careful. But I really, really like this eyeliner. And yeah, I lost the scrap to this one, y'all. I lost it. See, that's why I keep them in the inside. But yeah, I really like this one. Black goes well with everything. 
Next I have is this tennis shoe bag right here. I really, really like this little crossbody bag. It reminds me of Converse. Here's the scrap in the inside. And yeah, if you're a Converse fan, most definitely get this. I got this from, um, I don't even know where I got this. I want to say Dolls Kill, but I want to say HalloweenCostumes.com. But yeah, just look up tennis shoe bag and I'm pretty sure to pop up. I'm sure Amazon will have it. They got everything, but yeah, this is real fire and you could tie it and everything. Yeah, I really like this. Next we have is this telephone purse right here. Everybody loves this purse. This was one of my first purses actually that I started to collect. And yeah, this has some stuff in it. I don't know. Oh, I just keep like little like cloths and everything like to keep it from bending because these purses will bend. So that's why it's so heavy. And yes, you can attach this to your actual phone. And you can actually speak through here and all that stuff. But yeah, it really works. And yes, I got this purse from Dolls Kill. And you can hold it both ways. You can hold it either by this handle or you can hold it by this scrap right here. Next we have is another cereal bag, right? Well, another cereal bag crossbody box right here. It's this Ray Crispy bags. I really, really like this right here. This would have to be one of my favorite purses just because I love Rice Krispies. And it's kind of a play on that. And I always, you know, you got to go for the checker. The checker is fire. And yeah, here's the scrap for that as well. And... Here's a little close-up, and I got this one from Dolls Kill as well. Next is this Clorox Betsy Johnson purse. When I posted this first, y'all fell in love with it. Like, I did too. Like, this was fire. Like, this is, it's like takes a play on the disinfecting wipes, Clorox. And yeah, I really love the inside. Y'all haven't actually used this purse. I took pictures in it, but I don't want to mess it up. Like, it's just that beautiful. I really, really love the hot pink. You see, like, it's kind of matching my fit right here. Yeah, I really, really love that. And I really like all the details on this purse. Here is my Morton Salt purse. Y'all took pictures in this and you see like these purses that some of them are flimsy. That's why I like stuff, paper or towels or any any type of cloth just to keep them expanded. But yeah, this was really one of y'all favorites. Y'all really, really like this purse and I do too. And I have to admit it's very spacious. And yeah, here's the inside of it. Next we have is this little poodle purse. I don't know what happened to her little scrap back here. But yeah, here's this poodle purse. I really, really like this purse. And yeah, it went well with my pink and white Nikes. So yeah, really like it. Next is my telephone purse in black. Yes, I have two telephone purses right here. I think I might have three. I don't know, but I have two of these, this style right here. And yeah, this is black. I love black. Black goes with everything. I wore these with my Lightning 4s because... Yeah, that was the only thing that I could find a match with. And yeah, I have more cloths in here. Just to keep this from getting, you know, bent and everything. And you can connect this to your phone and everything. And yeah. I actually got this one from Amazon. Next is my Sour Patch bag. And yes, this has profanity on it. I don't know, but that's just the vibe. Here's the scrap for this one. I really love all the different colors in it and everything. And it... Y'all fail. It really matches with everything. But yeah, it's down there, y'all. I don't want to get all the way down there. Y'all seen it. But y'all really like that one. Next is my Egos purse right here. Y'all, I love me some Egos. I love me some Egos. Y'all already know. More cloths on the inside, y'all. Because this Egos purse, it's like made out of, what is it? Cardboard. Some cardboard can become very flimsy. And this is the flimsy kind. So, you know, we got to keep it looking like a box of Egos. And not a deflated box. But yeah, I really like this purse. And this purse is from HalloweenCostumes.com. Next we have is this burrito purse. Y'all, it's kind of bent up. I love this purse because it has the little burrito sauce on the side. My mom got me this actually for Christmas. And y'all, I, I really like this purse. Like these, is, this is one of my favorite purses because I love burritos. I love burritos. And it just gives that vibe with the little pouch of hot sauce on the side. And yeah, it's fire. Next we have is this tote bag. I made stuff I stole. I wore this with my black, um... Air Force Ones, yeah, because you know, it goes hand in hand. Next we have is this Airheads bag right here. I really like this one, even though blue isn't my favorite type of Airhead. But I settle for it as a purse, you know what I mean? I'm not I'm not tripping like that. And here's the handle for that one as well. Next we have is this large eight ball purse. Y'all really, really like this purse. And yeah, this purse is huge. It also has like a little part in the back. And here's the inside of it. I fit my whole entire sewing machine in this so that just tells you how much you can fit in this like i feel like if you're going like on a little vacay take this as a carry-on i don't know if you can i don't know if it's like i don't know but i y'all just try to do it i'm telling y'all y'all can fit a lot of stuff in here when it comes to clothes y'all bought them clothes up you can fit at least 100 outfits in here it's just that big and i was sent this by dolls kill so thank them thank y'all very much i appreciate it 
because this is most definitely going to come in handy. Next we have is another waffle purse right here. This is an actual waffle. The other one was the Eggos box. And yeah, you know, a good waffle purse. Like, I love waffles. Yeah, this is from Halloween Costumes as well. Next we have this punky. Well, it says punky, but I think it's called punky. I don't know, but it's these little... Y'all know when in the grocery store, these be fire, okay? These be fire. I remember eating these with my friends. These used to be fire. So it's a little play on that. I really, really like this. And, you know, pink is one of my favorite colors. So, yeah, I love it. Next we have is this high C bag right here with a penny stuck to it. I don't know why. And it plays, you know, like a little weed thing. Yeah. I love yellow. So that's why I really like this one. I feel like the colors are like the neon coloring. It's bold. And here's the handle with that one. Yeah, I just, I love this purse. This is another one of my favorites. Next we have is this fire hydrant purse. And yeah, y'all, it's a little deflated. So you, it's kind of hard to tell what it is. But yeah, it's really small and compact. You could fit a couple things in it. And yeah, I really like the texture of it. Next we have is this recycling bin purse. I love this purse. This was another gift from my mom. I'm telling y'all, she picked some fire purses. So if y'all need somebody to pick y'all bomb purse, hit her up. Afro Puff Jada Mom on TikTok, Afro Puff Jada Mom on Twitter, and Afro Puff Jada Mom on Facebook. Hit her up, y'all. She gonna get y'all scraped because I'm telling you, this is fire. She got this for me from Studio Coat Recycling Bin Bag. I took photos with this with my dunks, and yeah, this is fire because we all need to reduce, reuse, and recycle. Period. Next, we have is this bedazzled kind of like butterfly purse. I really like it. It's like rhinestones and all that. It's like really elegant. So I'm waiting on that elegant moment to pull it out, but until then, I'm just keep that safe in the vault. We gotta have some tricks up our sleeve. Next, I have is this basketball purse. I already I took pictures with these with my jubilee leaves it matches my leather jacket and yeah here's the inside of it i never actually put anything in the inside of it but y'all a basketball purse because we balling boo. next i have is this chest purse right here i got this from dolls kill this was like a year ago over a year ago i got this so long ago it comes with chess pieces you can actually play chess on this purse so I, if you like chest and you like purses i would most definitely recommend getting this here's the scrap i never like took the plastic off of it because i was saving it for a moment but yeah but yeah y'all this is chest purse and let me know if y'all any one of y'all want this i won't be using this because it was already used and i don't want to you know even though i had mentioned using it first i don't want to i don't want to come basically after somebody's and did something let me know if y'all want this purse because i won't be using this purse because it's already seen so yeah let me know I'm gonna, I'll send it to y'all. Let me know in the comments and I'll ship it out to y'all. Here's a Starbucks bag. It's actually broken, y'all. I was using this purse the other day like the straw comes out. But yes, yeah, black and white so it matches with everything. So I tend to wear it a lot. Peep all the receipts. Yeah. I really say it's really compact and everything. Aside from the scroll falling out, I really, really like it. Here's my little brown bag. I also has a I also have a medium brown bag. I don't know where it's at. I have stuff like everywhere in here and it's bent up, but I wore these with my easy slides and I got this from Bo Bloomingdale. Here is my chicken bag. This is another one of my favorites, y'all. Cause I really, really, really like chicken. And I was like, do I really want to pop out with the bag? And I'm like, yeah, I do. I love this bag. Like it's just so big, it's so soft. And I really love the colors and I really like how I paired it with my dunks and this is another this could be another carry-on bag y'all this bag is huge so if you need something to carry on I most definitely recommend this here's this other fluffy cloud bag y'all this bag is so soft and fluffy I really really like it with the red fabric on the inside like that's just fire I really like this bag next we have is another tea bag right here I actually got it. I think it's a TV I don't know actually it could be a radio y'all I don't know y'all let me know what it is but I like pastel colors and it's like really fire next we have is this little denim jean bag this is my absolute favorite y'all I know I didn't say I had a lot of favorites but this is my favorite right here look at the pockets like the denim like come on y'all that's all for this video i ain't get to do all my purses because my camera about to go dead but yeah most definitely i'll be coming with a part two and like i say like comment and subscribe and i'm gonna be posting videos every day for y'all so always come on this page and check on me y'all because i'm gonna be here waiting for y'all and yeah let me know in the comments what was your least favorite purse and let me know what was your favorite purse and let me know how y'all styled it but yeah y'all just let me know how y'all feeling it that's it we out